I spent a lot longer on this level than I expected to, and not for any reasons I expected to either. So we know we're going to have to punch out the shape in the middle, so let's see. Looks like that, so we're going to have to fill in all four of the corners. Okay, let's start over. It turns out this is actually very easy. We'll paint one side black, come right back around. Now, all we have to do is walk to the corners. Since we've only painted one side, this is pretty easy. Now we're going to have to punch out the center, but we don't want to step uh, on the black side, so let's go clear. This puzzle introduces the, these um, blue panels, which will erase your side and kind of give you a neutral color that neither paints nor erases. Great, now we punched it out. So we should be all done, right? Stand next to it. Nothing's happening. Isn't something supposed to be happening? Okay, let's, uh, let's try making ourselves black. Nothing's happening. Why isn't anything happening? So I spent a whole lot of time trying to figure out what the actual clear conditions are. Um, the, I guess this is the game's way of trying to teach you that you have to not only have your color correct, but you also have to be standing directly adjacent to the, to the portrait. But I don't think it does a very good job of it. I had to experiment way too much. They could have highlighted it more clearly in my opinion. Anyway, once I step down, we'll be adjacent to the puzzle and uh, colored black. Uh, the paddle is colored black the same way as the portrait. And there you go.